Hello folks, very exciting day here in the W2AEW lab. We have here a brand new Tektronix MDO 3000. So I thought I'd share the excitement and uh, do the unboxing on video. So let's take a look at uh, what we've got inside here. Well, unboxing videos may not be that exciting, but an exciting day for us here in the lab. So we've got uh, the usual paperwork, uh, the sheet of all the accessories, and uh, the calibration certificate in here. Uh, we've got a uh, BNC cable for the arbitrary function generator. And uh, the demonstration guide. And it looks like uh, four of the 1 gigahertz passive probes. These are 3.9 picofarads of loading, 1 gigahertz of bandwidth in the passive probes. That's fantastic. Let's see what we've got uh, in here. Oh, it looks like a demonstration board to uh, typically uh, folks that uh, bring these out to do, to do demonstrations will use a board like this to uh, bring up different signals rather ranging from RF signals to uh, digital signals, bus signals and things like that. And it's used to make it nice and convenient to demonstrate all the features of the oscilloscope. So that's what the uh, that demo board is for. Uh, the power cord. Okay, information about the latest firmware, and of course the uh, safety and installation instructions and the user manual. We have over here. This is the uh, little pouch that would attach to the back to hold the probes and accessories when you move the scope from bench to bench. And uh, we've got uh, this is a USB cable that's used to power up the demo board. And we've got uh, a little bag of accessories for the probes and things like that. And uh, also the last little, on, last little bits in here. Uh, the instruction manual for the demo board itself. A, uh, this is the N to BNC adapter for the spectrum analyzer uh, input. And of course the series of documentation on a DVD. That takes care of everything in the top tray. So we'll pull that out and take out the unit itself. So there's the, the MDO 3000. Uh, a, I'll, I'll try to resist the urge as, uh, as Dave did to run my nose across it and smell it uh, as much as uh, we all want to do that. So there she is. There's the new MDO 3104 mixed domain oscilloscope. Now, of course, also included in the box uh, was this box here, and this contains the digital probe for the mixed signal, or the, the digital inputs of the mixed signal scope. So this gives us our 16 digital inputs and all of the various connections to be able to uh, hook into uh, digital circuits, either through square pin headers or mini grabber clips to uh, grab onto circuit elements, component leads, and jumpers, and things like that. Okay, so let's do uh, the first boot, the first power on. So we'll reach in the back here and plug in a power cord and uh, take off the uh, note to register the product here and hit the power switch. Yeah, I'm not sure what the boot time is on this, but we'll see. Uh, the, uh, the note here to register the product is kind of nice because uh, with the MDO 3000, the DMM option is free, and all you have to do is register the product. So I'll hop online, get my registration code, and enable the DMM on this scope. So uh, we see it uh, firing up here. You know, most of these scopes, they're loading firmware and things like that as they're booting up, so it's not unusual for them to take uh, you know 30 seconds to a minute to boot. So uh, let's go see uh, how long this one takes here. So certainly looking forward to uh, featuring this scope in. Uh, future work we do here on the bench. It's going to, I think, be really helpful. And certainly at a gigahertz of analog bandwidth going to be more than uh, uh, any other scopes that I've got here on the bench in terms of bandwidth. So there we go. It's all fired up and ready to go. So just a short video uh, to kind of share the excitement here, the new MDO 3000. And uh, again, keep on the lookout for future videos where we'll be using the scope and putting it through its paces to show some features as well as just to use it as our basic uh, go-to scope here on the bench. And uh, thanks again for watching.